Today, we're gonna to walk through the steps on how to enable and change the homepage within the newest version of Microsoft Edge. Stick around. Now, before we jump too deep into this video, if this is the first time here, welcome to the channel. I am Aaron and you are on Help Cloud and we focus on pretty much everything tech related here from unboxings, tutorials, reviews. You'll find a lot of types of those videos on this channel. Now, if that is something that interests you, of course, consider subscribing. We also have a merch line, so head on over to shop.helpcloud.com to get yourself some merch today. What is going on, everybody? Welcome to another tutorial. When Microsoft released the new Microsoft Edge update, they completely changed the architecture and of course it changed the settings on the back end. So today we're gonna walk through those settings. I'm gonna show you how to first enable the home icon and then I'm gonna show you how to set a specific page. That way when you click that little home button, it will take you to that specific page. So with that being said, let's go ahead and just jump right in. To get started, you're gonna wanna of course open up Edge either by if you've got an icon on your desktop or on your taskbar or if you don't, you can just type in Edge within the start menu and open up the Microsoft Edge browser. From here, you're gonna to want to navigate up into the top right-hand corner to click these little three dots right here, or you can use the keyboard shortcut that is Alt and then letter F as in Frank. Those will open up that menu right there. From here, head on all the way down towards the bottom and click on the settings, which is a little gear icon right there, and let that page finish loading. From here, moving to the left side of the screen, you're gonna to want to navigate and find where it says appearance, it also has like the little uh, painting artboard or the little painting palette right there. You're gonna want to left click on that once. Now from here, you're gonna wanna come on down to where it says customize toolbar. And if you don't have your icon showing, your home icon showing right here, you're gonna wanna make sure that you toggle this switch either on or off depending on what status yours is. So mine was default off, but we're just gonna toggle it once and that'll put the home button right next to the refresh button right near the URL bar. Now, if we were to just press that right now, it's gonna take us to google.com. Yours may default to a new tab page where if we just open this up and we click the home button, it's just gonna refresh this because it's set to open up the new tab. But if we were to go in, click the little radio dial next to this field and then just type in any website that you want. So if it's yahoo.com or Google or Facebook, whatever it is that you want, Type that in there and then you want to left click where it says save. From here, it's going to save that address as your new home screen URL. So if we go back to that new tab to test it out, click on the home button, you can see that now it's going to load yahoo.com because that's what we've set in this field. So whatever you've set in here is what it's going to load whenever you click that home page. And that's just an easy way to go in enable the show home button or enable the home button and also change it to a specific page. Now that you're a master at changing your home page within Microsoft Edge, if you will, that is going to wrap it up for this week's video. Thank you guys all so much for watching. Be sure to click the share button, click the thumbs up or subscribe or do all three because those things certainly help us grow our channel. Thanks again for watching. Thank you guys all for your support and we will see you on the next one. Peace.